Who's the best middleweight? You got Charlo, Danny Jacobs, Canelo. Yeah. Triple G. Yeah. Okay. That's a, that's a, that's that's a, um. That, but that's, at 36, would he still beat them young guys like like Charlo? Charlo would, Charlo would give him some problems, but Triple G is a monster, man. Oh, shit, you can't. Uh, you can't take nothing away from that man, man. That man, that man is good, man. Even if age ain't nothing but a number, man. I mean, I, I'm, I'll be 40 this year. We, I'm the, me and my strength coach talk all the time. We, you know, we define logic, and I feel great at my age. So uh, I know I'm gonna do this shit to another five years, as long as my body holds up. As long as I'm in competitive fights and I'm putting myself in a good position to compete or win a world title, I'm good. I'm good money. So. And first things first, never look past what you got coming up. And I know I got I got a tough one in uh, Harrison. Where I take care of them, go on vacation, and then see what's next. Now I, I do got to ask you about the, the, the division, the champs, because uh, you got you, you were at Laura versus Hurd. That was a great fight. Um, is, is Hurd or is Charlo the best? Because it seems like everyone agrees that's the top two dogs. Who would win if they fight Char Charlo and Hurd? Well, you you got to you got to give the the man right now is. Uh, her. Right. He beat the man. Right. You beat the man. Right. You become the man. You uh, like they say, and you know you got the juice now. So you got to give it to him, man. He beat the man that was the man, and now he's the man. So does that mean so, when they fight though, he beats Charlo? I mean, he, he's gonna be a tough customer for anybody because of how how big he is. Um, he's a very big. I don't know in the history of this sport have I ever seen someone that big make the weight like that. So yeah, I think he'll give anybody a problem. I thought Laura was doing really, really good. You know, and it was a very entertaining fight. But just all that leaning on him and just warring him after a while. He's a very big kid, man. Are you a Jared Hurd fan? Because he seems like a guy that other fighters uh, even like. He's a good, he, 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 he's a throwback. He keeps it simple. Don't talk a lot. You just go out there and handle his business. So me being a throwback and being coming from being around all the greats through my years, I mean, you're talking about a two, almost a 20, 20 year pro career. I gotta respect that. So I respect what he's doing. Of course, if I was to ever fight him, then you know that respect would go out the window. But I respect what he's doing, man. He's just a, he's a throwback. He even fights like a throwback.